Hi beauties, welcome back to my beauties big sister channel. My skin is feeling quite good today. I haven't done anything, I haven't put any creams or anything on at the minute, but it's feeling good from doing my sheet mask yesterday and doing my nukes treatment. So I think that my skin is looking pretty good. So I thought that we'd stay on the natural vibe and do a no makeup makeup look today. I'm gonna to be using more skincare than makeup. I'm gonna put on mascara. Um, I probably will put on a little bit of concealer, but other than that, it's just gonna be skin glow dew and a bit of color to my skin so let's get straight into it the first thing i'm going to do is tattoo my brows because my brows are looking a bit sad at the minute aren't they so i'm just going to brush my brow hairs up so we can see the shape this is the maybelline tattoo brow i did do a full video on this before but stuff is really really good if you're not very good at filling your brows in or if you want to just do them once every three days, this is your answer. Um, so it will last about three days. It does, admittedly, look best on its first day. But it's really quick and easy to do, actually. So just paint it on. I am using the medium brown. I normally use the dark brown, but I don't know where it is. <laughs> I'm using the medium brown for this. And obviously, it looks extremely dark when you paint it on. Trust me, it works and it looks good. Oh my god, last night, guys, <laughs> I was such a twat. So I got yesterday's video live. I then was on the phone to one of my friends. So I didn't even think about having dinner until about half eight. And when I did, I, the stove, like the hob, wouldn't turn on. So I freaked out and thought, wow, another appliance has broken in lockdown. Um, it turns out after... I had to cook my pasta in the microwave. <laughs> uh, it turns out that I had the child lock on the hob. Who knew? I didn't even know you could do that. So, um, yeah, that was last night's drama. I was going to carry on filming the rest of this look while these were sitting on my brows, but I'm just going to look nuts for the whole entire video, aren't I? So I think what I'm going to do is let it like, do its thing. I'll leave this for about 20 minutes and then I'll come back. So glad that the postman didn't come while I looked like this. It has been on for about 20 minutes now. So I think, yeah, it's ready for us to pull off. Mm, I do prefer the dark brown shade rather than the medium brown. So if you have got dark hair like me, I would go for D. It literally just saves you from having to pencil in your eyebrows. So if you're not very good at it, this is a great little solution. How good does that look? And natural as well. You freak out when it looks like that, don't you? <laughs> but actually, once we've pulled it off, I think that's so good. I'm really excited to try this, actually. I didn't even know I had this until I just quickly looked in my drawer. So this is the Tattoo Studio Brow Gel from Maybelline. I've got the shade called Deep Brown. And it's meant to last for days. I don't know, I've never tried this before, so I'm intrigued. I will keep you guys updated with what I think of it. But yeah, it's a brow gel that lasts for days, apparently. So I'll lick these brows up. I don't know whether my brows just look a little bit messy. Mmm, I don't know if I'm enjoying that, to be fair. Right, I've just took off that um, brow gel. Not a fan of that. So much better without. Uh, they were just getting way too big and dark, and it was freaking me out. So I'm just going to go in with my Barry M brow gel. This is a clear brow gel. Nice, natural fluffy brow right let's go in with our skincare i haven't put any skincare on my face today and i'm dying to get something on there so i'm going to take my favorite day serum which is my elizabeth arden vitamin c capsules i cannot rave about these enough they are the best of the best so these capsules have your daily amount of serum in oh, i really need to tidy my desk and this formula oh is so 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 hydrating it's just one of the best serums out there for my moisturizer i've been using this lately it's not i wouldn't say it's probably the best for like glowy makeup today um it's not necessarily glowy but it is very very lightweight and it protects against everything the the stats behind this the ingredients the clinical results are incredible eight hour daily defense moisturizer spf 35 pa plus 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 protects against pollution it protects against blue light it is just the perfect formula very very lightweight sinks in nice and quickly 
um, also sits under makeup nice as well if you're looking for a moisturiser with your protection in um, and it doesn't break me out which is a game changer for me so yeah I'm really really loving that moisturiser I'm then going to go in with a spritz of my Saint Pay self tan purity natural glowing skin bronzing water face mist that was a long name um, I do love my Isle of Paradise high glow self tan serum I did actually feature this in yesterday's video so if you want to go and see that I will link it above there but just to mix it up and this does give me a darker tan the Saint Pay so I'm just going to miss this on i completely cover my face it's also really nice and hydrating to do so just let that soak into the skin it gives you a really really gorgeous color Probably should have gone in with my eye cream before i just done that but i forgot so <laughs> we're gonna go with this eye cream i haven't tried this before this is from transformulas it's the marine miracle eye zone and um, this sounded like it was going to be what I wanted today. Uh, minimizes fine lines and wrinkles, firms, tightens, depuffs, reduces dark circles, improves skin tone, hydrates, plumps, restores eye radiance, anti-fatigue effect. Sounds pretty amazing. Also really like the packaging of this, but I've now got cream on my hands, so I can't open it. A little bit underneath my eye. Skincare is just the best step that you can invest in to get your skin looking good skin's looking good and radiant you don't need makeup we want to really create that glow on the base layer on the first step that feels really nice and lightweight i'm gonna go in with this i'm thinking that this doesn't class as makeup it probably does it actually really does but it's more of like a skin perfector type product so becca under eye brightening corrector this is really good. Can you see the kind of colour it is? It's a correcting formula. So it does kind of conceal, but it just corrects the colour. So if you do have uh, dark circles underneath your eyes, this underneath your concealer will look amazing. I'm just going to see what it does for like on its own. I haven't actually used this product in quite a while. And you know when you forget how good something is? I was just having a rummage through my makeup wardrobe and I was like, oh, I used to love that product. This side, this side, you know, it just gives you that kind of lift. So just gonna pop it on any blemishes that I've got just to lift it a little bit. Again, as I said, I don't really wanna, if I can go without putting concealer on today, I think I will. It doesn't feel heavy, it doesn't feel like a concealer. It feels like a, an eye cream, to be honest. How gorgeous. Yeah, happy with that. Right now, obviously you guys know that I do love Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Filter, but I do feel like I've featured this in loads of videos, so do love these. I use shade 4 or 5, depending on how bronzy I want to go. But I also do love the By Terry CC Serum. I would say this probably gives me more of a colour and more of a glow. I don't know, I think the Flawless Filter is a bit more subtle. So this just gives me a little bit more. Um, this is in the shade Sunny Flash you'll be able to see the kind of radiance that it gives my skin so this is the cc serum so it says hydration radiance color correction it looks a little bit orangey when you first apply it i feel but then i feel like it does kind of die down and this is great for those no makeup days so i've just done that half of my face hopefully you'll be able to see the difference <laughs> you can majorly see the difference in my skin so this is without it this is with it so it then just matches down to my neck without having to wear a foundation without having to wear tinted moisturizer this is definitely more lightweight this is your skincare with a little dose of color in it so your skin is definitely being able to still breathe but i i do just adore adore this formula I just like to work it in with my hands you can apply it with you know a brush or a sponge but I, I do feel like with a sponge it kind of soaks it up quite a lot because it is a serum so I feel like just working it in with your hands does work wonders right now obviously I do look very very shiny so I just want to mattify those areas where we don't want that shine I'm just going to take the bare minerals bare pro fair powder this is just going to set down that shine but it's not going to clog your pores bare minerals have even said that this formula is gentle enough to sleep in it's 
that light you could literally sleep in this it doesn't clog your pores at all so just a little touch of this will just get rid of that shine and I'm using the fair shade so it does actually just brighten up that area and I'm just gonna pat that down right curling eyelashes if you don't do this please do this because once you start you'll never be able to stop I adore my Dior <laughs> eyelash curlers look at the difference already bam curling your eyelashes will make such a difference to obviously the curl to the length it will just push them up like a push-up bra look how much more defined my lashes are so if you want to obviously go without mascara if you're just gonna use your eyelash curlers i personally can't be without my mascara so i'm just gonna apply a little bit this one is actually nearly run out so i'm not getting super super defined black big lash look for that i am loving the mark jacobs at lashed um, so for more day to day i'm just really enjoying my classic roller lash benefit but the difference that curling your lashes makes is actually mad well, i am going to take a little bit of my flawless filter because this is a bit lighter than my by terry this is in the shade four medium again this is just like a skincare perfecter but you can definitely use it as your highlight um just one of the best formulas ever isn't it this is probably my number one product within charlotte tilbury just oh, the glow that it gives your skin one product that i actually I, I adore this but then again i forgot about this product and because i saw a lot of my products out to give to my friends one of my friends was like oh, that bobby brown lip balm you gave to me i am obsessed she's finished it already she's already bought another one so i was like yeah it is really good isn't it and it's got color in it as well so it's your lip balm and your color in one but it's a really really natural range of shades this one is called bare nude i also do love the i think it's called bare sparkle it definitely still looks like a balm like the pigment's not there like a lipstick and it feels like a balm as well it's super hydrating no this is technically not allowed and i was going to finish my makeup here i just really want a bit of blush <laughs> and because this is a cream formula the fenty one feels like skincare um this is crush on cupid and i'm just gonna press that into the skin cannot tell you how much i love this formula and it just lifts the skin straight away it looks so natural like if you proper buff it in it's gonna look like you've just had like a rosy flush it won't look like you've got makeup on beauties this is my no makeup makeup look let me know what products you love to use for creating this kind of cheat i woke up like this look thank you beauties so much for watching if there are any products that you want me to review if there are any particular videos you want me to film then please do let me know in the comments if you are new here we're uploading every day monday to friday we're going live stream on youtube at 6 p.m on monday please do join our family of sisters make sure you subscribe and i will see you in tomorrow's video bye